overhead as LMPD was in pursuit of a car involved in a carjacking. The driver weaving in and out of traffic, occasionally driving onto the shoulder. It was when he tried getting off at Dixie Highway that he crashed into a pickup truck towing a boat. All I seen was the car that hit me and it veer off to the side and I got out of the truck and I didn't know what else was really was going on. Stephen Snip was on his way back from a day on Taylorsville Lake when he got caught right in the middle of the chaos. As I got out of the car, I noticed like all the guns were drawn and everything and I didn't know what the juveniles, what they were going to do. So I was kind of scared at the moment. Officers pulled two people from the car and took them into custody, but it wasn't until Snip saw the video of the crash that he began to process exactly what happened. I actually didn't actually realize how hard the collision was until I seen the video of it. And then after I seen the video of it, like, you know, it, it all came back to me. I was just in shock whenever it all happened. Snip's boat managed to make it through with just a few scratches, but parts of the trailer are broken and the truck is totaled. Snip says losing his truck hits especially hard because he relies on it for work. I'm a small business owner. I own my landscape business. So, I mean, this truck actually, you know, provides food for my family, for me, my house, my bills. So it's, it's my work office. It's not just a truck to me. Snip says the crash has also left him feeling pretty sore, but despite all that has happened, he is just grateful it wasn't any worse. Very, very fortunate. It could have been uh, bad in several different ways, and it could have been somebody else with, you know, kids in the car, and I'm just glad that, you know, it was me instead. Now, no one else was hurt in this crash. We're told the two juveniles were taken to the hospital to be checked out just as a precaution. Live in the newsroom tonight, Drew Gardner, WLKY News. Thank you, Drew.